Welcome to Matheson College. I'm Jamie Fish. Some students arrive on campus with clear career ambitions, but most students need some help figuring out which field of study is right for them. The good news is, help is available. I'm here with Jacqueline Auden, a career advisor from the Career Services Department here on campus. Ms. Auden, you've advised a lot of students over the years about choosing a major and a career path. What should students consider? Well, Jamie, one of the first things to consider is your personality type. Well, along with your skills, abilities, and personal preferences, your personality type can guide you toward finding a major that best suits you. Okay. So how many personality types are there? There are six basic personality types. Hmm. Artistic, conventional, enterprising, investigative, realistic, and social. Now, the first type is artistic. These people are creative and imaginative, and they prefer to work on one project at a time rather than multitasking. What careers should artistic types pursue? The most important thing for this type of people is being in charge of a creative project. So careers to consider are landscaping, graphic design, web design. I see. The next personality type is conventional. Tell us about that one. Yes. Conventional types are practical and orderly. They respond well to rules, procedures, schedules, things like that. Hmm. What types of careers do conventional type people usually enjoy? Conventional types often enjoy numbers, and they're also good with measuring and analyzing things in general. So often they tend to be bankers, lawyers, building inspectors, and technical writers. Are they good business people? Sure, they can be. But they usually work for others. The next type, enterprising people, those are the business owners. Ah, the enterprising type. What characteristics do those people share? They tend to be leaders. They're independent and willing to take risks. They're good at motivating people, so we often find them in sales. Really? Hmm. What careers do they enjoy, aside from sales? Well, they're good at directing projects and people. So they make good managers. Okay, so that's three types. Let's take a look at the fourth type, investigative. Well, this type of person prefers logic to imagination and tends to be precise and detailed. So Jamie, what are some careers that you think would suit this type of person? Hmm. Science would probably be appealing. You're right. Uncovering mysteries is key to any type of science. But librarians are also the investigative type. Really, any career that involves research fits into this category. Hmm. So that brings us up to the fifth type, realistic. Yes, realistic types like to work with their hands, with tools. They want to see the results of their work in physical terms. Hmm. That sounds like repair people to me. Yes, that's right. Also jewelry makers, builders, and engineers. So now for the sixth personality type, which is the one that describes me best. Yes, I think you're right. <laughs> the last type is social. Social types like people. Their jobs usually involve helping and communicating with others. Oh, but teaching would appeal to social types. Oh, yes. Medicine, coaching, broadcast journalism, and, of course, career advising. That's us, social types. Ms. Auden? Thank you for sharing this information with us. It was my pleasure, Jamie. Well, we hope this information has been helpful to you. If you'd like to learn more, visit the Career Services Department and tell them Jamie sent you.